Uh, hello, we're back. And I brought a very special guest. Because she actually followed me. It's... Tori! <laughs> and she's wearing her little sweater. Um, Tori's my favorite dog. Ever. Not even out of... Like, all the... Like, like of the dogs I own, definitely. But of all dogs I've ever met, Tori's the best one. She's the best. Aren't you? I love you so fucking much. Um, she, uh, used to bark at me every time she saw me. Because, um... Until I shaved my beard. Because she hates my sister's boyfriend. Um, he, my sister's boyfriend also has a huge beard. And um, I think her eyesight is probably not the best. So when she, when she would see me, she would start barking until she would like get a whiff of me. Or like I would get closer and she'd realize I am not him. Um, and now what, now that I've shaven, she never barks at me anymore. So I, she legitimately like had trouble uh, discerning us, which is very funny. Um, but now she's pretty cool. Right? You're such a good girl. All right, I'm gonna let you out. <laughs> go ahead. You're good. There you go. All right. Oh. <clears throat> yeah, my literal dog. Yeah. <laughs> um, I think she she definitely didn't uh, anticipate being on on the stream, so she was a little, little camera shy, you know. Okay. All right. I am just really glad to be doing. Oh, hey. Ramsam, also, I changed my uh, donate message. Ta-da! Fifty or uh, ten money. I was gonna say five thousand money, but you know, listen. Uh, <laughs> I'll give you ten money if you give me the first place medal. Oh, okay, Setzer, you want that? All right, I'll uh, I'll meet you in the back alley. I'll I'll trade you off the uh, first place medal, which I totally didn't deserve for the uh, kahoot there. All right, let me. Uh, this is still pretty loud. Also, uh, Cloud eight seven six ninety. Thank you for the follow, and uh, Glass Scientist, which is coming through right. Oh, holy frosty, holy frosty. All right, let's just wait for this to play and I'll, I'll catch up on, on the good news here. <laughs> you guys are really uh, healing my wounds tonight. I, I really do appreciate it. Um, there you go, frosty with the 10 gift subs for Sammy Struggles, level story, son of the fire 55. Okay, it's that one over there. Aleph C, Get Roxel, The Krusty Crad, Jack the Bagel, Dane Mergen, and The Bone Dome. Frosty, thank you so much for 217 total. Look at that. Thank you so much. Um, again, as I said, you have uh, you guys have helped heal my wounds. I, I'm, I've been licking my wounds after this disaster of a start to the stream, but I'm ready. I'm reinvigorated. I've got a good attitude now. Uh, yeah, you maybe you should have done the chores earlier uh, during the jungle line. <laughs> I think maybe the chore buff could have come in handy IRL. Yo! Um, Andrew, thank you for the th uh, thousand bits there. Thank you so much. Uh, be more cheesy. Yeah, I'm trying. I'm trying. Andrew, thank you so much. And enjoy that fucking little Destiny Islands chime whenever that plays. Actually, I don't think it is Destiny Islands. When does that sound play? Um, Kim K before. Thank you for the follow there. Um, yeah, I'm trying to think. Like, when does that noise play? It's it's somewhere in Cage One because I got it from like a Cage One sound effects folder, but I have no idea where. I just liked how it sounded. So apparently, I don't know anything. I did win the Kahoot. I do have the gold medal to prove it, but. Um, I might make another Kahoot just to, uh, I'll do it myself as, as penance for everything today. Um, is it Chess and Traverse Town? Is that it? When you uh, do a Trinity Mark? I don't think it's that. Um, if someone wants to donate bits again, we can hear it again. No, I can probably, can I test it? Would you hear it if I tested it? Oh, look at that. Yeah, what is that? That's not Trinity Mark. What is that? I have no idea. Yeah, no clue. Um, if anyone knows, let me know. <clears throat> is it the mailbox sound? No, the mailbox is like, kachunk, and then it goes, I think it's just like the, the follow noise when you get a, an item in. Or maybe, is it? When you get a, a thing? Like from the uh, postcard? Gummy ship vibes? I don't know. That's going to drive me nuts. Because yeah, I probably knew what it was when I assigned it, but for whatever reason, Twitch just, like, overrided it and used its default noise this whole time, so. New magic? I don't think it's that either. No, that, that one's a little more high-pitched, I believe. When you synthesize, that sounds like it might be on the right track, Carly. I feel like it does have to do with synthesis, actually. Well, look at that. Apparently, you can donate 10,000 bits, and it's red. That's crazy. Um... Gummy hanger? Or is it gummy hanger? It's not synthesis? 
When you fire the door? Well, ooh. No, that can't be it. When you hit the... When you shoot fire at Merlin's door? I don't think so. God. <laughs> gotta get... We gotta get, like, the best in the biz on this, because clearly it's not me. <clears throat> yeah, just come in and donate <laughs> 10,000 bits. Alright, we're back, folks. Um, I have no idea what this VOD's gonna look like, if I'm even gonna have this split up by... Uh, I just split the Kahoot into one, or maybe not even upload the Kahoot. Who knows? I, I should upload it, um, because people worked on that. But I'll just have to, like, splice 60 different pieces of video together. And then maybe we'll just start the BBS one. Hello, we're back. Um, yeah, where is David Russell, the sound genius, when you need him? Um, David Russell just got back from uh, MAGFest over the weekend. Him and Chain and Fabio and Liz, and DS Music, they were all there. It seemed pretty cool. I was getting some pretty massive FOMO, but maybe next year. Um... I was actually exposed to COVID on uh, New Year's Eve, and um, I was just waiting to make sure. If I did get tickets, I probably would have felt pretty not good about going because I wasn't sure if I was in the clear by then. I feel like I am now. Still have to cough, but I've had that since before COVID, so. <coughs> Unless it's the longest COVID and I was actually the true patient zero. Um, also, Star, thank you for the uh, the uh, eight months there. And yes, the one year uh, recap, I do plan on doing like a uh, highlight reel um of the uh, best moments of the one year of streaming on twitch um between february 14th of 2021 and like nowish you know um hopefully nothing crazy happens in the next month that i won't be able to include but i'm, I'm starting to work on that now um what color are Terra shoelaces he doesn't have any he's just wearing his fucking armor shoes underneath that's crazy look at that that's weird i actually never noticed that but that that's definitely the same shoes on his armor right is he just wearing the armor underneath this that's crazy I didn't send the notification. Oh, and on, on uh, Discord, you're right, I did it. Well, it's probably for the better. <laughs> I gotta stop beating myself up over this. But uh, I'll, I'll just say, oh, by the way, we're streaming BBS now. And then I will link to Twitch. But to recap, if I do decide to split this VOD, I, no, no. <laughs> No! <laughs> You've got to be kidding! It's not fire the door, I, I promise. I promise. God damn it. Alright, let's try this again. You all saw that, right? You saw that it was... Yeah, he was small, okay. Yeah, I gotta take my, uh, my sweatshirt off, I'm dying. Some might call this strip KH. I wouldn't, but some might. Okay. Yeah. Where my Gorillas self-titled album shirt. Got a fucking boot up BBS again. Shirt check. Yep. It's the uh, classic Gorillas Jeep. You got who's driving anyway? Looks like Murdoch's driving. You got Noodle and 2D in the back. And Russell's like in the trunk type thing. And Andrew, thank you. <laughs> Thank you for the 100 bits. Andrew says, Fire the door, Pat. Fuck. Is that like a band name? Fire the door, Pat. Fuck. Indie rock. All right. I'm going to boot up this again. I promise one day this stream will work. <clears throat> Come on. This booze could not act quick enough. There we go, baby. There we go. Yeah, it's not the same, Andrew. We promise. When Andrew says fire the door, he means, like, when you cast fire on the magic house. Um, I wish you were right, Andrew, but I just know you're not. Ventus loses his temper over the bad internet connection and land of departure. Ah, I'm Ventus. I'm a screamy little boy. I have, like, two bars here. What the... Oh, yo, uh, Seasalt309, thank you for the 20 money. 20 money. And uh, your 20 money makes my day. So what, a, what an equivalent exchange. Um, thank you so much. I really appreciate that. Also, fucking simple and clean. I can't. I can't play. Everything is shot. <laughs> Yo, thank you so much, Sea Salt Trio. It was very generous. Um, okay, let me just clear my airways again. <coughs> ah, I'm Ventus. I'm quite old, you see. You kind of got screwed on that impression because I got donated in the middle there, and now I'm just. I just want to play BBS. To be honest, that's all I want to do at this point. And hang out with you lovely folks. Also, I got high jump. So, okay, I did, like, four command boards between this stream and the last. 
Um, and I happened to pick up High Jump from, I believe, the 100 Acre Wood Board. I could be wrong. Um, and now I have once more and second chance. Look at that. Do I have... I don't know if I actually got Leaf Bracer or not. Let me see. I got Combo F Boost. I do. So I have all these goody good abilities that I'm going to be using in my fight against the Trinity Armor. Um, probably take this off. I don't need, really need to use Ignite on him. I don't think. Um, I don't know what would be good. Um, you know what? I fucking love uh, Command Board, so I actually had a great time. It was fine, you know? Sacrifice. Well, I might as well have it in there to level up, but I don't know if I'll use it. I don't think I've ever used Sacrifice. That's crazy. Um, yeah, we, st we still don't know what the new cheer sound is. We don't know. Um, no, Chris, we're still getting started here about an hour and a half into the actual stream. We're getting started on BBS now, so... You're good. Okay. Um, anything else? Do I have anything else to report? I don't think so. I hope you enjoyed the recon video as well. I'm still, like, recovering from that whole editing binge. Yes, yes, nachos, indeed. 200 bits from nachos. New cheer sound. Yeah, it's actually the old cheer sound. Like, I've had it forever, and it was always being overridden by the Twitch default. And I, fi I found a way to turn that off. So, um, that's the, uh, the whole idea there. Um... Also, it smells like darkness. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, it smells like darkness. Who is a new patron of mine uh, for the uh, the two months there? Appreciate that. Um, Thank you so much. Good. I'm glad. I'm glad you liked it. Okay. Good. Good. I'm glad because that was uh, that was a big project. It was supposed to be a small project in between two big projects, and it ended up being another big one. So at this point, I don't know if I'm gonna get my next one out in time for when I want it to be out. Um, so we'll just have to wait and see. I want it to be out before the end of January, if I can help it, but that one ended up taking way longer. It was supposed to be like a half hour easy one, ended up being like a 50 minute, pretty ex expensive, or not expensive, but um, extensive one, rather. All right, let's just fucking do something. God, I, I have to stop that on first, of course. Yeah, let's do that. Let's see. <clears throat> I just gotta drink this faster. Okay. Anyway, how's everyone doing? Um, another uh, What If KH video? I probably will. Um, you know what I found is that, like, uh, so far at least, I've kind of just been copying my my formula from 2021. Um, well, kind of, right? Like, I ended 2020, uh, 2020 with the boss ranking, and I did the same with this year, or this past year, 2021. And then in the new year, what was 2021, I did the KH1 compendium. And this year, I did the Recon Compendium. So, by, by that logic, you might see an alternate history thing around March or April. But, no promises. I'm just saying. Um, there's a bit of a pattern there. Had a rap song in the uh, fall of 2019. Had a rap song... No, 2020. Had a rap song in the fall of 2021. So, there, there are patterns, you know? Maybe a manga video part two? Yeah. <laughs> am I consistent or am I predictable? That's That's the question, you know? Um, unfortunately, you just missed the coup. <laughs> like, you missed it by a lot, actually. The game is extremely quiet. Alright, let's see. Let's see. How about? Now it seems loud. Is it okay for you guys, or too loud? Lucario, I can just play the bit noise. You don't have to, you don't have to keep donating. The coup's over. It's done. <laughs> I, we don't even speak of it anymore. <laughs> Is this good? Okay. Um, no, I, I hate to uh, I hate to curse the memory of the Kahoot because Gavaka looks so hard on it. It was really just my internet that was the problem. Okay, all right, but that's what we got. That's what we got. Second chance and once more. It's not too loud or too quiet. If it if it seems like I'm shouting over it, then I I want to change it. All right, Carly's going to Traverse Town to investigate the bit noise. But again, if you want to hear it again, I can just play. You don't, you don't have to donate to hear it. Because I feel like I'm yelling over the audio right now. Look at that Leaf Bracer coming in clutch. A bit loud? Yeah, that's what I thought. That's what I thought. All right. How about... No. I know, I, I know, Frosty. It's, uh... I mean, I, I just need to get rid of Streamlabs, to be honest. It's so bad. Um, 
I was told when I was getting started that it was easier to use. It was like more user friendly than regular OBS. Um, so that's why I went with it. Shit. Come on. Come on. Oh, my death counter's not here. Um, and then it turns out that they're a bunch of thieves. And their shit just doesn't work. So it's like, I don't care how fucking user friendly it is. It's not very ethically friendly, is it? Let's see that death counter. Hello? I should have 38 deaths. Where are you at? Why aren't you showing? Show yourself. Why? Why not? 38 deaths. Hmm. Well, I don't want to remove it. <clears throat> well, just believe me for now, folks. This stream is a fucking disaster. <laughs> so, I have 38 deaths. And I will, uh... Did I drag it? Yeah, it's, definitely, it's at the top of my stack right now. And it's... Oh, there it is. Okay, I it literally didn't have the eyeball checked. I unchecked the eyeball a million times. But, there we go. Okay. Alright. <laughs> Easy. Let's just, uh... Let's one shot. Let's just one, one try Trinity Armor. How about that? Can we make it happen? No! I'm back into fire mode. Oh, we're doing work. Come on. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. God, they're so strong. Here in... Or, uh, off on Ventus. Here, too, I guess, but... Oh, my God. We are just bullying it. Get back here. Oh, no. Yes, yes. Should probably not use both cures if I can help it. Ooh, see? Okay, come on. Oh! oh. Shot through the heart! Alright, 39. It's an HSD. Hit the Jabib. And, Wenjane, thank you for the follow. Let's retry it. We have we have uh, information on the the noise. Let's see. Let's see what is it. I told you, Carly was right. That's not it, Carly. <laughs> That's not it. <laughs> oh no. Let's hear it again. Yeah, it's different. And you can probably hear it from my desktop audio there. Very quiet, but yeah, it's different. Do they? No, they're different. They're different. Good try, though. Good try. Also, I got a friend request. Let's see. Oh, it's my new patron. Wait, no. They didn't accept it yet. Never mind. I'm trash. Whatever, I'll accept it. I accept everything on Discord. All right. Back to this. <clears throat> they could have pitched it. Same sound, different note. Different names, same fate. To quote Psy Axe, I'm going back to how I said it. I'm reverting. Alright, come on, let's get it. Oh! Heavens! <laughs> heavens to Betsy! No! Alright, come on now. If this Megstar Lemonade could kick in a little faster. That was rude. Also, Frosty, and I don't know if Corn's here or not, but um, don't try playing your command because I'm not even fucking with the chat bot today. Are you kidding? So no, uh, no, that's just plain rude. No cage to screw us again today, unfortunately. No cake. I can't risk it at this point. I don't think it is the same noise. I mean, it could be, but like Frosty said, I think it's it's pitched differently. This attack, jeez. All right, you gotta go. You gotta go. Fire. Come here. Ben, get it. All right, you're done. Uh, curses on my screen? You're right. Thanks. <laughs> Thank you for the 100 bits to let me know about that. Nachos. God, I am just the biggest amateur on Earth. Okay. <clears throat> you know what amateur means? It means a lover of. So, I'm a, a Twitch streaming amateur because I love the game. But God, does it hurt sometimes. God, does it hurt. Also, I missed all those HP balls. Shout out to that pile of balls that I missed out on. 
So sad. Wow, that destroyed. Fishing for Raga. I'm fishing for some damage. No, no. Yeah, let's save one of the cures. Let's not just throw that out. Also, you gotta go. Goodbye. Alright, I got all those balls that time. That's good. Good news. Trying to block these. Alright, they're not coming for me. Cool. Alright, let's not even try to attack right now. Let's just let's just dash through these. Boom. Boom. Oh, fucker. That actually scared me. That actually frightened me. I was a scared little puppy. Alright, come on now. You done? Destroy him! Is it possible to kill yourself with sacrifice? I don't want to find it out right now, but I think I do later. Okay, okay. God, Leaf Bracer's so good. Oh my god, they're doing work. They're doing work. They'll kill him for me. Do it. Do it. Fuck. Um, yo, holy fuck. It smells like darkness. $40.90. Money to help the pat, because why not? Yeah, fucking... Why not indeed? Why not in Wobbuffet, dude? I mean, thank you so much. That's crazy. I can't believe how much of a shit show it's been today and how supportive you guys have been. I mean, it's really no surprise. It's really no surprise that I have some of the fucking biggest legends in the KH community having my back here. Um, wow, thank you so much. And you just became a patron today as well. So that is uh, no small feat. Um, I really appreciate it. Thank you so much. It's the opposite of... of uh, actually, it's the same as Sora's feet. Very big, very large feet right there from uh, It Smells Like Darkness. Which, um, did you just make your Twitch account today? Because that is very, um, reminiscent of the uh, nickname conversation we had in, uh, in the Patreon channel today. That's what they say, that, Legends supporting Legends, that's right. Is the noise from the start of the game when you choose options? I don't think so. I think that's a pretty iconic one I think I would notice. I don't know. Um, if we can get Kino, maybe, he might know. Although Kino's not a big cage one guy, so... <sighs> oh, thank you. Thank I mean, I see a Legend, I see... I see 109 legends in chat right here, so I mean I can't see all of them because not everybody not everybody talks. Some people lurk and that's fine. Some people are voyeurs. They just like to watch. Yes, the noise here comes. Bring? Is it when you use a tent specifically? A tent? I don't think so. I do love the uh, the um, follow noise. I love all my noises. <laughs> I especially love this this next noise. Oh, look at that! Thanks, John. What's my host noise? Is it just the, uh... Oh yeah, it's the Moogle, of course. Boop, doo, doo, doo. Look at those. Look at that host number. Man, I was so generous to host my stream to 536 viewers. Okay. Alright, let's let's just take care of this guy. I got a cure real bad. Alright, I did it. Okay. Alright, let's just back off. Let's not risk it. But now we're gonna get the biscuit, baby! Oh, we did it. Alright, basically the game's over now that I have these abilities. I've basically beaten the game. And there's gonna be no more deaths. So, look forward to that. Biscuit obtained. Come on! That's pretty cool. That's 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 a really sick shot right there, actually. It's really good. Yeah, yeah it does get sad, though. The vibes are just destroyed, just like the shreddy armor. The chocolate biscuit is now mine. Got him. <laughs> we make a good team. Sure do. Sure do. And that was the last time they would ever fight together outside of a cutscene. Well, Cage 3. But even then, Terra's, uh... Fen, Terra, and Aqua, they're all in the tornado in Remind, actually, so... I lied. But for a long time, it was the last time. I love that, by the way. That'd take two grown-ups. Sorry for talking over it. Any tips on Cage 2 level 1? Not really. I suck. Um... <laughs> I'm not going to lead you astray and pretend that I'm an expert on that. You have cage one level one questions and maybe I could help. Want to hear the sounds? Yeah, I'll do it again. Here we go. Bring! Look at all my bits. Wow, look at all my bits, says regular Pat before he was canceled. Chris, boop -boop -doo -doo. thank you. <laughs> you let Aqua take you home. No way. No way, I'm a big kid. I eat big kids' meals. We have a task. The toy in there is for grown-ups. Cool toy. Bionicles. Transformers. Remember when they sold the whole Optimus Prime with your Happy Meal? I'm grown up, I swear. That's my, now I'm using my terror voice on Ven. They're all unlabeled? What the fuck? What's wrong with people? 
I said the grown-ups table. Okay, what the fuck is Aqua talking about here? You know, Kiwi texted me about this recently. Where's my phone? Was my phone in my hoodie that I threw off? It is, because it's heavy. I'm gonna see if I can find this. <laughs> Cause I was we were just like aghast at this scene. Let me see. I'm just gonna search Aqua in my text history. Hopefully it happened within the last year. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Hmm. Come on. There's actually I still have history of us talking about the crocodile project. Hmm. Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay. So, Kiwi texts me, you know, Aqua becomes something of an asshole in Radiant Garden. And I said, that's not what the Master asked you to do in, like, the Spongebob mocking voice. Kiwi says, I've been to the same worlds as you, and I've seen what you've done. Really? In those worlds, you kept saying he was fine. So what's with the sudden brass balls? <laughs> I said, also, literally the only time he did anything bad was Enchanted Dominion, and he was being possessed. In Dwarf Woodlands, he did nothing wrong, and in Castle of Dreams, he was actively helpful. And then Kiwi says, well, yeah, I mean, everyone in this conversation knows the Terra Dumb narrative is dumb. I said, damn, Aqua's on Reddit confirmed. <laughs> so, fuck all the Terra haters out there. Fuck all of you. He's a good boy. He did nothing wrong. Terra Kingdom Hearts. She heard one fucking thing, and it wasn't even true. All right? Also, Tristan, thank you for joining. I hope you're having a great evening. I sure am, especially after this alcohol is kicking in now. I slurp this a little faster. Listen to yourself, Aqua. Terra would never. You mean you've been spying on me? Is that what he said to do? <laughs> Master's orders. Crocodile Part Two. Maybe this year. <laughs> I'm a Terra and Donald defender to the death. I will say with me, Carly. I will die on this hill. All right. <laughs> Really? Tell the master he can fuck right off. That's right. Tara and Donald, the winner and the runner-up of the Hunger Games. Donald killed himself trying to escape. My cursor's on the screen. And the volume of the game is so low. Subtitles are huge, aren't they? You must be Tara. It's that old cooch. He won't stop asking for you. I came all the way out here to get you. How about now? What do you mean? Ah, do I have to spell it out? Xehanort, whatever he's called. Is his is his uh, dialogue coming through cleanly? It's brain. <laughs> Not a very good liar. Master Xehanort would never let himself be caught by a thug like you. Glass scientist, you called him stinky. You're probably right. He is kind of stinky. See for yourself. I'm holding him under. Do you not have the word coot in uh, the UK albums? Um, <laughs> Everything looks like our oh, love. <laughs> I sound as good, 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 good. Uh, Birdo Jester, hello. Burning Mandala, hello. See, now it's way louder for me because of this fucking blaring Radiant Garden music. Oh, we have to go fight him now. I just realized we have two bosses as Terra and Radiant Garden. That's crazy. Also, can I get that sticker right now? I wonder. They have high jump. Also, I can do this now, which is my favorite. Okay. Anyway. <laughs> his neck, his back, his pussy, and his crack. Um, I hope they hear this music. Yeah, I can't reach this right now. But can I? No, I can't. Maybe later. I must have done that at least 20 times there. He's thrusting his entire pelvis. Yeah! 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 It's so good. And I can just, like, approach people like this. Your elderness, wait! You dropped your book! Wait! There might be valuable stickers in here! Come back! I'm starting my dominance, that's alright. Thank you, thank you for the buff. Pet the presto, also, he's even, yeah, he's tilted there. He was tilted as much as I was. He's very hairy. <clears throat> Come on. Um, the lonely nerdette who made this Platinum Presto, I saw on Twitter, was um, trying to gift Sarah Zed of, like, BreadTube fame um, a uh, shiny Shinx for her um, <laughs> Pokemon Diamond uh, playthrough. 
which is like the strangest but funnest crossover ever, so. You know, my dogs, my Presto does not leave this microphone stand if I can help it. Um, sometimes he'll fall off, but I always try to replace him there. Alright, let's fucking save. How about that? Make a little bit of progress tonight, huh? Could you imagine if the game crashed? The game actually did crash while I was doing Command Board. Um, you thought Coot was a type of water bird? <laughs> Owls. Owls, you're the fucking bird in the chat here. You should be the bird expert. You're the expert, Owls. Um, can Terra death drop? I don't know. Mostly because I don't know what that looks like, so. Rate the Disney dogs? I think I've done that on Twitter, actually. Is Coot a type of bird? <laughs> Ribbon Fly. Ribbon is a, you know, Ribbon Fly is, is someone who is in the air, so Ribbon Fly might know. Um, Daisy, I can play the bit noise. You don't have to, you don't have to give me bits. Here you go. Here it is again. Also, Shabalako! Thank you for the follow. Um, can Terra drop the people's elbow? I think so. I think, and definitely with the one that, uh, is, got that, like, that guard thing on his elbow there. I don't even know what you, that's what he hits to do his, uh, armor. But, god, Terra's design is actually really cool. <laughs> I'm just, like, really taking it in right now, after 10 years, 12 years. Um, would I consider myself built different? I mean, here's the thing. Um, Jason is the most, uh, differently built. But after him, I might be, like, the next most differently built. But it's hard to say. I don't really like to quantify these sorts of things. Because it's not, like, a contest. But I'm just trying to be objective. <clears throat> An old duck. <laughs> yeah. No, I think... You don't really call people, like... I feel like coot is always preceded by the word old. It's like, um... It's like the word, um... What am I thinking of? Oh. Shabby. You never say something is shabby. You say something is not too shabby. You know what I mean? Um, I'm getting a lot of redemptions right now. One sec. <coughs> um, my favorite Disney movie is The Lion King. Um, I'm a basic bitch. If Deep Jungle did make it into Calm, what do you think would be the enemy card abilities for Sabor, Clayton, and Stealth Sneak? Well, Stealth Sneak, they probably would have given the invisible ability from the Gargoyle and given the Gargoyle something else. Um... I think Sabor could have been something like... What does Sabor do? Sabor jumps into the bamboo thicket to hide. Um, I don't know. Sabor's... I don't even know if Sabor would have gotten a card because not everything... Like, Pot Centipede didn't get a card, you know what I mean? So I don't even know if Sabor would have been translated into the uh, Castle Sam. Oblivion version. But, um... You're right. You're right, Runfly. I thought hyenas were dogs. Super embarrassing. Um, the Clayton... Again, Clayton and Zigbar's ability probably would have been similar. Carly has a bone to pick. There's so much happening. It's it's hard to keep track. I need I need like a, an assistant for uh, like fast chat days like today. You know, so many redemptions and questions and and pickable bones. What are you doing plugging someone else's Patreon in my stream? <laughs> that should be bannable. That should be bannable right there. Oh, you're right, Carly. I do owe that. It's not happening today. I'll tell you that much. But maybe on Saturday. The Audacity, the Adobe Premiere. You know what? Fittingly, that was what I promised I would do if you guys liked the Super Spike Getty Bros podcast episode that I was on. No, you should. If you have money to spare to the Spike Getty Bros, you should pledge to their Patreon. They just launched it today. Ooh, I like that, I say, I say. Um, Sabor card makes Dodge Roll do damage. Kind of like how um, you can make Cartwheel do damage in this game. <clears throat> The old man said he would give me his. As if. Alright. I like that there's a cut there to imply that, like, that was happening for a lot longer. This probably should have been my top 100 quotes. I love that. You're not very... What's the word? Good. Right. There are precious stickers on the line. Oh, so hello, Kamori. Bow, bow. Brig is in my S tier. I mean, Zigbar is at least. Tawa. Also, on a coyote. Thank you for the follow. Coyotes are dogs, mind you. Trust the heart of the stickers. He forgot the word good. He has to look it up in the dictionary, like Syx with motivation. Um, average Mario brother, as opposed to the super. I I feel that like a regular Mario brother. That's what I would be if I were in that universe. What's poppin'? Just Mary. You know how it be. You think that Xehanort knows that Brig is Lushu? I don't, actually. Um, I think Lushu has way more knowledge about the universe of Kingdom Hearts than Xehanort does. But, I don't know, is that a hot take? Um, 
I had a lot of trouble fighting Brig when I needed to get footage for my BBS video. But I also didn't have any of the abilities, so... Maybe I just beat the shit out of you. Boom, 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 boom. Oh, that's not gonna help me. Come here! Whoa. What is happening right now? Wendy's cashier. Hi, Pat. One sec. Ten-piece chicken nugget combo? How fucking dare you? You think that because I come in every Wednesday at this time and order the same thing, you have the right to memorize my order? You know who does that kind of thing? Ansem the Wise and King Michael. I'm a complex man. I'm not just a routine. You're a bad man, Kyle. You were an A-tier employee, and I'm bringing you down to C-tier, along with Susan, the manager, just for that. So what do you have? Okay, fine. I'm going to order the 10-piece combo nugget uh, meal, but my, my, my point stands. My point stands. Alex, Kyle, whatever your fucking name is. <laughs> I can't believe that you fucking remembered that Spider with the Dragon VOD story, Lingual Logic. Because I know when I told the story about how the Wendy's guy memorized my order. <laughs> and now you've memorized the story about it. That's crazy. Layers. My cursor's on screen. This stream is going to go down in history in like a bad way, I think. God, fucking die! No! Wow. Okay. Why? Don't do that. It's not going to help. Get confused, idiot! Doesn't work on bosses, obviously. Can I even... Can I guard that? I don't think I can. Come on, stick to the beat. What happens if I sacrifice right now? I don't die. Oh, I really gotta heal. Mm, that was close. God, his regular combo does like nothing though. Wait, I can I can dealing, can't I? I can't guard that. So, what's the dealio? No! God, God bless Second Chance. I want some more, whatever the fuck it is. There's a character in Fallout New Vegas who says that in like the same sing-songy tone. And I always, it always reminds me of that. I believe it's in the Old World Blues DLC. This is gonna take forever! How about this? How about these apples? Ow! Oh, shit. Dickard! Oh, yeah. I only have one Kira as Ven, so I couldn't go to my other one. Um, I can see you. I'm lurking in your stream. It's actually it's Dr. Mobius who says it in Fallout New Vegas. He goes, I can see you. Now I end you. Oh, so close. Wow. Okay, I'm horizontal, just like Terra's corpse, and we're gonna reconvene. All right, so we're gonna we're gonna rally. Ugh. Did I add a death? I did. Shot locks, yeah, that could help. I mean, I was just uh, I was kind of on autopilot that whole whole attempt there. Um, sorry, I missed I missed a lot of messages there. Go for ignite. Do I, do I have that equipped? I don't know if I do. I don't. Alright, I will equip it if I die again. Yeah, apologies. If I'm, like, uh, in the middle of a boss fight, I might not get your uh, your messages there in the real time. But I will try to... Don't feel weird about resending something if I miss it. This is a very fast chat day, even faster than our other streams in the past week or so. I think I just want to be in the Vendee link um, if I can help it. Damn it, don't bother with that, Pat. Come on. Got your nose. Give me my stickers. I know you're holding out on me. Oh yeah, this is the move. This is the way. Stop doing that. Pat, doesn't work. When will you learn that you actually have consequences? I think I think I'll do days after like maybe as like a hundred and fifty patron goal or something. Gotta set more goals, you know. 
Or maybe you're gonna steal like a Twitch sub goal for that. I don't know. I feel like um, people on YouTube won't, won't really care about being patrons just to see me play days on Twitch. So maybe if we make a sub goal. Stop doing that, Pat. I need to stop doing the counter. My brain is like, you gotta do it. You'll get more damage. I'm in like cage three brain. That's not how it works. All right, let me. Um, so if I continue, I can equip ignite. Um, let's see. Although I, I won't have it. I'm in my D link. But uh, let's see. I'll get rid of. Uh, I can take these off out of my command deck, and I still keep second chance, right? How does that work? The um. Okay. All right. Let's do ignite. Um, the PS4 Final Mix version of BBS still has a shot lock, a soft lock uh, condition that can be met in the monster boss. The game wants to put you outside, but it has to resolve your jump first. Oh, I had no idea about that. It's crazy. Um, okay, right. So they're fully leveled up, so they're mine. Good. Good, good, good. All right. Um, so let's go back into the fight. <coughs> Renewal block. Do I want that on instead? I combine Asuna and Kiraga, or Asuna or Asuna or Kiraga plus block. Okay, I'm gonna look into renewal block after this death. I mean, after Bragg's death and he never comes back. Duh. You know where else there's a lot of happening? The regular Pat Patreon. <laughs> Nachos be chilling. Thank you, Nachos. We're very close to that goal. Oh. I'll tell you, if we do hit the goal, um, that'll probably be like, it'll be the second video, second next video that I do. I have a kind of time sensitive one that I want to have out before January, which I don't know if it's going to happen. It might be like early February at this rate. But um, then the next video, if we do hit the goal, if people don't drop off, will be the Disney sequel video. <clears throat> Take this! Ow! It's okay. I should have ignited him before I went into the Vendi link. I'm not thinking. Ooh, that was very generous of the game to give me that. Door. Alright. Oh, that's nice to get that while the uh, thing's charging. What? Hello? Okay, that was rude. Why did I cure? No, stupid. Ow, idiot! Dumb! My back! <laughs> and other things as well. Oh, he's doing four? Four shots? Cringe. Break, don't you understand? I am speed. I am speed. <clears throat> um, Ava does not have a Patreon, no. Not that I'm aware of, at least. But if she did, I would spend every waking moment undermining it. No! Oh god, we're good, we're good. Okay, just barely. Fuck, that sucks. Wait, I should I should get out of my D-Link and heal. Oh, this is bad. Oh, we did it! Okay. <laughs> we did it! I do like this song. It is uh, uh, Black Powder, I believe, is the name. Woo! Hey, tra uh, drink the jungle wine. Sorry for almost doxing you there. Um, I think I have before, actually. Whatever you prefer. But thank you uh, for that. You don't feel obligated to to give back. Um, you you all give to me in, in whatever way you can, just by being here and watching. It's uh, it's more than enough. Obviously, I appreciate any uh, any further support. But um, and girl who likes Kate the best. If if I am to uh, believe the reports, did you not win the the uh, Kahoot game about my videos on uh, Saturday? Because I think I missed that in the real time. But were you high pat on the Kahoot? If so, congratulations. I was consumed by anger. Hatred. That was the power of darkness. Darkness that you... It was the power of Jehovah. No, I told you to stop trying to no. convert me. Tawa. I succumbed to it. Just like That's what I was thinking, yeah. Yeah, so congratulations. I said that I would call whoever won a cool dude, so good job, cool dude. <clears throat> 
yeah, Briggs jumping away animation. It's very strange. It's like, because it, it makes you wonder, is he like channeling his space energy there? Because he is like the, uh, the space elemental in the organization. And, um, you know, I would figure that most, um, I would say maybe all of the organization members do not have their elemental attributes until they um, become a nobody. <clears throat> you could just be using like Lushu powers, you know, because Lushu's probably got his own chunks up his sleeve, so. Ericus, he's so cringe! He's very cringe, you see! Lucia uses Zigbar teleportation in a in a uh, a Union Cross cutscene, so he predates. So interesting, interesting. I mean, I'm sure this has been pointed out, and I've I've probably pointed it out myself. But like, Zigbar is Lucia, and he's uh, space, and Luxord is kind of opposite. And that reminds uh, scene is time, that space and time, and unreality. Like, you know, it's a happy coincidence probably that Nomura had these two characters be assigned that element back in 2005. But pretty cool, isn't it? The space and time characters are like really uh, having some interesting interplay. <clears throat> See more worlds. See more butts. <laughs> Do we have a see more butts here? They're time lords, yeah. Huge brain move by Terry here. Get the fuck out of here, keyboard win. Really dealing with Keyblade Glider Ven today, bitch. Oh, good job. Good job, Gabaka. You're faster. Click on the draw. Have I played the uh, Knights of the uh, Knights of the Republic games? I have not. If you couldn't tell by how long it took me to uh, decipher that anagram. But yes, it is um, very reminiscent. Very uh, um, analogous with the Star Wars stuff, uh, BBS. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Yo, Jarrah's theme! Fucking dicks out for Terra's theme. Oh my god, it's so good. I love it. It's my favorite. It's my favorite. Easy. Take me with you. <clears throat> They're all so hot. I mean, Luxor's hotter than Zigbar, right? Conventionally. <laughs> Master Zane or Pushin, yeah. That one doesn't get a, a ton of use, but... Time to rock out with the cocks out. Like where the Atlantica or the uh, Little Mermaid box are. You're my friend. <clears throat> Luxord has those earrings, yeah. They're very pronounced in 3. I feel like they weren't that pronounced in 2. The uh, Luxord earrings. Zigbar is hotter than Luxord? Okay, I don't know. As a straight guy, I think Luxord is more conventionally attractive than Zigbar. I think Zigbar's personality is probably more attractive. But I'll, yeah, I'll give you a poll, yeah. Alright. Who hotter? Go ahead, have at it. You horny animals. You got old coot again. I, know, I think Zigbar smells like the ocean and cigarettes. He's got this whole situation in two, you know? Like, right now, I could see that. I don't know, even still, I think I'm taking Luxord over, over Bragg here. As if. Luxord's winning. But I kind of put my thumb on the scale there. Ugh. And an eyeball. I would be focusing on the eyeball. Um, her name is Aurora. I'm going to coax it out of him. With stickers! He loves them, you see. He's addicted to it. It's his morphine. <laughs> Princess whatever it was. Put some respect on her name. Even though she probably doesn't deserve a ton. She literally just kind of sits around. Ah! I mean, by far the most boring of the seven uh, princesses of light, yeah? Princesses of heart, rather. Look at my fake fan ass. Boom. You know, just kiss Ericus and calm down. <laughs> You up? I'm texting you on my gummy phone. Luxord is daddy, Zigbar's a cool uncle. Yeah, that makes sense. That makes sense to me. Well, I guess conventionally we will be returning to... Or not returning, we'll be going to Disney Town first, right? That's five, and this is... Oh, they're both five. Well, get ready for the fucking Mickey Mouse March.
<clears throat> Extremely joke, here we go. I also found this one. Also, Terra's gonna be the victim of a hit and run soon. Let's get that joke. What did Snow White say when her photos weren't ready yet? What did she say when her photos weren't ready? Well, photos have to develop. Um, I'm trying to figure it out. I've solved like at least three of Allison's jokes before, right? You can you can corroborate that statement, right, Allison? Oh man, that's so Thanks good. Someday my Maybe prince will come. The name's Tara. Ah! Nice to meet you, Tara. <laughs> Great joke. That is so good. <clears throat> that's really good. I'm sure you had your reasons, but I can't say that I approve either. Well, down with the monarchy. Okay, he has a fucking point. Like, they're terrorists. They are invading forces in this land. So, like, I don't know. Maybe they shouldn't apply. Maybe rules shouldn't apply when you're dealing with these fucking bloods and scrappers. It's not like slurs. <laughs> they become horizontal again. Like, this is the closest Terra ever gets to doing something wrong. Terra is, like, being irresponsible on the racing course. That's the worst thing that he does. And then he, like, forces an epiphany on himself at the end because he let these fucking chipmunks and this rat lady gaslight him. I can't say racing interests me. You're a bad person, Terra. Tell me what I've got to do. And he's like, I guess I am. You're right. I learned they don't always have to bend the rules to get what you want. Hmm. Well, we've only ever seen the monsters on the track. I usually am a big fan of Chip and Dale, but not in this game. You just need to enter the races. I don't know why. I don't care for them here. <laughs> the photo op, the slander photo op. I have to become a racer. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Now I'm sure I don't have to tell you. I know. I'll play by the rules. I can't believe she's got her wedding ring on. Why are you still married to this fool? <laughs> you're right, Barnabas. Chip and Dale are jerks in the cartoon. I do, you're right, Gabak. You're, you're completely right. I'm a fair-weather friend to the chipmunks. I'm not a big rodent guy, you know? I don't like rats. Street rats. Hello. Um, not right now. I've got stuff to do. Looks like I've got some things to do. I'll give a, uh, I'll give a cool dude to anybody who knows what game that's from. Looks like I've got some things to do. What is that from? Bop, 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 bop. Answer now. Does anybody know? Is she wearing her wedding ring? She is. It's not FF10. <laughs> no, good guess. Good guess. It's not Demix. It's not a Kingdom Hearts game. It's in the intro of a game. The protagonist says, Looks like I've got some things to do. <laughs> Come on. There's gotta be some true gamers in here. That's right, that's right, Lingua Logic. Spyro's got it. Yeah, that's it. Hades. No, not Hades. <laughs> hey, yeah, looks like I've got some things to do. You come here often? There you go. <clears throat> mm hmm. Spyro 1, 1998. That's when all the dragons get frozen. Popcorn! God, I can't wait to finish Mr. Robot. I'm almost done with it. Um, I'm on season 4 now. I watch uh, TV on like 1.7, by the way, so that's why I, that's how I get through it so fast. Um, I, I thought of it because there's a popcorn machine that's featured prominently, and uh, also Luxor is the hottest. Um, I actually I actually played through all of the original Spyro games um, already. You can see on the second channel. It's right here. There's a playlist with every single um, every single part from all three games. But, but, uh, but maybe I'll go back and play the original trilogy and not the remakes as a change of pace. Oh. Oh, yeah, you're right. <laughs> Hades, as in the game. I was thinking Hades, as in the guy. Crispy chicken strips? Did you bring it up for the whole fucking class? Um, well, it depends, Scott Vodka, because you could make uh, microwave popcorn and just throw it in this movie movie theater-looking machine. So it's hard, to, it's hard to say. You know what's crazy is uh, I went to my first, like post start of the pandemic uh, movie 
what did I see? Oh, Spider-Man. I saw, um, I saw No Way Home. And, um, my theater, like, had a butter shortage. It was weird. Like, I've never been in a situation where you get your popcorn at, like, the, like, the concession stand. And then the guy's like, oh, so there's butter over there. So it's like, you have the butter, but you're not putting it on for me. I have to go, like, it's just fine. I'd rather go and do it myself anyway. But it was like, and then when I went to go put my butter on my popcorn, it said, due to, due to a butter shortage, the butter is over here now. Like, it didn't make any sense. Like, if there's a shortage, then why, why would you move it? Like, if there was a shortage, wouldn't there just be no butter? I don't get that. Has anyone else had this experience since the, <laughs> since the pandemic started? Like, I was very confused. I was like, because every, every other time I went, they would ask you if you wanted butter. So it's not like they would just default put butter on and they're like saving the butter by letting you choose if you want to. They always asked, you know, because <laughs> the staff drinks the butter. <laughs> I don't think I have a lurk thing set up, Frosty, unfortunately. You can teach me how to do that, too. Unless it just does it by default. I don't know. I've never done it. As a theater worker, you must be a clown if you think I'm getting that, that butter on my hands. Get out of here. <laughs> All right. Fair enough. Fair enough. Um, it's just weird, like, if it's, if there's still a shortage, if there's a shortage, then just keep asking me, keep asking people if they want butter or not. Most will say yes, I think, because most people aren't psychopaths. Or don't care if they're gonna die early. Um, where am I going? I wanna go into the sewer hole. Where is that? Here we, here we go. I'm gonna go do the coolest room in, uh, Disney Town. The butters were not exotic, I must say. They were, I mean, they were good. I love movie theater popcorn. Make a dog and got vodka going to war. Also, really cool environmental puzzle here. That's a trap right there. Um, they give you two thunder commands just so you have enough to do it, I believe. But we do need to equip the right stuffs. Thunder! God, I just, remind, I just said that in like a weird voice and it reminded me of the fucking Imagine Dragons song. God, I hate that song. Oh, it's so bad. I listen to a, a station that's like half 90s, half like modern music, and uh, they play that a lot, that Thunder song, and that's an instant knob turn. Nope. <clears throat> I always come back. Um, doesn't Hades say that? <laughs> no, I'm not sure. G give me, can you narrow down the category for me? I always come back. Thunder! Feel the thunder! Lightning and the thunder! Thunder! Ugh. <laughs> oh, yeah, I don't I don't play Five Nights at Freddy's. I've never played it. You know what I was thinking of, actually? Not Hades. Syndrome. No, he didn't say that, though, does he? He says something like that. He's like, Your son. I'll get your son. I'll be back, or something. Oh, yeah. By the way, Chris, on that, fucking check this. Ready? You fucking can't! I was told that they patched it out of the PC version. You literally can't do it. Um, apparently, and I, I think who who described this to me? I think it was Luna in Discord. Um, it's like the coding that they used to do it on PSP. Like they were easily able to carry that over to PS4 and PS3, but like they couldn't for PC or something. So it's like what? I was so mad when I found out about this that you just can't do it. You would think, like, you have a fucking keyboard right here, like, uh, it would be the easiest to do this on, but, uh, but nay, you cannot. I've, uh, I've pressed every button I can think of. It's just not a thing. And, um, I know you could on PS4 because I have footage of, uh, of my commands being named different things in my BBS-related clips, so. It's a fucking shame, I tell you what, but, you know, the world ain't fair. Right? And I said, that's what I said. I was like, well, I guess this isn't the definitive version of the game. Most people would call the PC version of a, of a game with all the all the fixins, as Jeff Probst might say, the definitive version. But despite having all these Final Mix exclusive bosses, so does the PS4. And the PS4 lets you name your commands. So I guess this is not definitive. What a crock of shit! Oh, come on, Terra. Terra, come on. Yes. All right. We're going to the rec room, baby, which is the second best room. I mean, this is so cool. Like, there's nothing like this in Cage 2. This whole room is better than everything but the Cavern of Remembrance, and even some parts of the Cavern. This is great. The fact that there was a little puzzle down there that made you use a specific spell slash command. I mean, that's so good. Can we just... You know what? I'm going to turn around, and we're going to just really take this in. 
read this in. Look at this. Platforming. Movement. It's totally optional. Survivor Seasons ranking? God, I would love to do that. Maybe as like a quick Patreon thing, but I, I can't I can't invest a ton of time on that for YouTube, unfortunately. Um, yeah, so I guess Pete is a terrorist because they gave him this big room down here and he lives in the sewers of the town, so. And there's a sticker. Did I get it? I don't remember if I got it. Found out. <laughs> my joy when I talk about world design. You're so right. It's one of the few things that causes light to shine in my eyes. This part, though, can probably eat butt, if I had to say. I had to describe how it makes me feel. This eats ass in, like, a bad way. <laughs> This whole exchange, I don't like this. Like, I think it's really neat, right, in concept, but in control, not so much. It munches butt, you know? <clears throat> I feel like I've been very vulgar this stream. I'm not, I'm not sure what's gotten into me. I'm just so, uh, so worked up about the whole, the Kahoot of it all. You old Kahoot. Did I already unlock the thing? Or no? No, it chimes when I get that. This is for break time, by the way, which is mostly just a... Novelty. Oh wait, I did get it. I did get it. Wow, I'm so good. Um, I'm willing to call that like the fastest acquisition of break time ever. Am I just like the king of the world? Or is that not what is that not how you get uh Did I not hit all the things? I'm pretty sure I did, and that's how you get break time. You've done it faster? Whatever. Uh fake news. I have proof. Do you have proof? Because I have proof that it just happened, so. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -da. All right, we're gonna fuck off. Um, if only we had. Hmm, can I cheese this? I don't think I can with what I have. Also, prize pods? No. Slot edge. Um, I have a couple of dashy moves, but I don't know if that's gonna help me. I have sliding dash. I have fire dash. I think that's all I have. I don't think that's enough to make it over. I'm going to lose altitude too quickly. I only have two dash commands, though. Right? Yeah, the rest are magics. I will try it. I do not have sonic impact. Uh, what order? Did it drop down this way? No, it drops. So I got to use this one first. Okay. Let's go. Oh, maybe? Oh, we did it. Wow. I did not expect that to work. Cool. Traffic cone. I got a new sticker. Eric is going to be so proud. Alright, can I go actually go back to the town square? Can I do my sticker book. Let's see. Boy, oh boy. No prize. Where's my prize? I want a fucking prize. That's from a musical. Anyone know what musical that's from? I just listened to the soundtrack to that the other day while I was finishing up editing, actually. Where's my prize? Um, Neil Patrick Harris is actually in it, at least one of the uh, one of the recordings. <clears throat> Bum -ba -no. Not twisted though. Not company. Um, Stephen Sondheim uh, was the uh, songwriter there. I missed the chest back in the uh, raceway. Not kinky boots. Not twisted too. <laughs> what's another song from that? What's uh what's another what's my favorite song from that musical? Come all ye Christians and learn from a sinner. Charlie Gato. Bound and determined he'd wind up a winner. Charlie had dreams that he couldn't let go. Faced with disaster, his heart would beat there you go, assassins, that's right. Assassins! Very cool thing that I uh, was first introduced to in my uh, sophomore year of high school, I believe. Hello, Geisifer? Is this the true Geisifer from my past? Hello, what's going on, dude? Notice me, notice me. Consider yourself noticed. What's going on, dude? How are you? Um, going pretty well, Recruit of Apollo. It's been uh, it's been a lot easier since I leveled up my abilities. Um, or rather unlock them. Alright, did I get the chest that I missed? I'm like... It was, it was down here, right? And I got it? Um, Geisifer is someone that I know IRL. He's He's got the deep pat lore. Don't embarrass me. <laughs> don't don't tell them about the embarrassing photo of me at the Christmas party. Um, Alright, I, I have to do a race now, unfortunately. 
Let's rank the uh, Disney Town mini games. I mean, this is the worst one, right? I don't know though. Fruit Ball's the best. Also, Nachos, thank you for gifting a sub to Guys Super for 158 total. Um, I have never told Guys Super of a time where I sold myself. I don't think I have sold myself since I was about three. I definitely did when I was three, though. Oh wait, no, I did, Guy. Um, <laughs> in Freak K3. I, uh, I stole myself on the playground. Yeah, that happened. <laughs> Remember? Ms. Mrs. Fivus? <laughs> yeah, that was a funny story. It's one of my earliest memories, me shitting myself on the playground. <laughs> I was three, what do you want? I thought it was a fart. <laughs> Pre-K- No, no, Pre-K- Pre-K 3 was the first Pre-K that it was available to me, I swear. Guy can corroborate. Uh, I've known I've known Geisifer for 20 years, maybe. Does that sound right to you? Bam, 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 bam. Right, shit yourself these days. People give you dirty looks. They scrunch up their face as if they smell shit. Yeah, guy and I went to a private school together, and it just fucked us all up. Right? Nobody escaped that place with the sounds. Mental health. Boom, boom, boom. Latrezy! Latrezy, I don't mean to put you on the spot, but are you a patron on my Patreon? <laughs> because um, I messaged you and you ghosted me. But I was pretty sure that the person who pledged was you. And uh, I was like, I, I credited you as the thing that you gave me on Patreon. But I was I was like, I'm pretty sure this is Latrezy from Twitch. If not, then, well, I guess I cell phoned myself by making an assumption. Also, I'm just fucking it up. I'm drunk driving. I do know who Matt Pat is, yeah. We make fun of him a lot here. <laughs> Don't tell them about my eight fingers, guy. Yeah, why are there five laps? I've only confirmed four of my fingers to guy. I don't think guy... Guy, can you name any of the organization members? Because guy, I know, played Cage 2. Um, I know Guy knows about Dance Water Dance. Main navigator. Absolutely not. But you know Dance Water Dance Guy, though, right? Okay, I thought so. I thought so, Latrezy. Do you want me to credit you as Latrezy? Um, in credits? I, tip I try to default to whatever the Patreon name is, if I don't have any other information. That's a good guess, Guy. That's a good guess, Sephiroth. He is not in the organization. But he is a villain that you can't fight in Kingdom Hearts. I did. I went to private school. 15 years, actually, I went to private school. From age 3 to 18. Um, fucking Pete. What a load of bunk. Also, it's kind of impressive that he made it through that tunnel without eating shit. I hope he crashes and burns. Yeah, I honestly, like, private school, I think is more valuable for... Because if I went to a public school in my area, I would have been beaten up, you know, just for being the person that I am. Um, so I think private school for me was more valuable in the sense that it protected me um, from kids that would do me harm, more so than the education it provided, if that makes sense. Gotcha, yeah, I will I will make a note of that, Latrezy. Everyone has flying vehicles, beat ass Chevy. That's why, like... He's pushed to the edge. He's forced to live in the sewer. And he's given this fucking shitty car. You know? I mean, I don't know. If I didn't go to uh, the school that I went to, I probably would have just been a much different person. So it's hard to uh, really trace the butterfly effect of it all there. Whatever. You were against me at the start of this world. <laughs> fucking fair weather rats. I reject this entire hypothesis. Favorite song from Encanto by far was We Don't Talk About Bruno. I've listened to it at least once a day since I watched it, and that was like, I think the day after New Year's. So, I haven't listened to it yet today, but it's going to happen. Because it just, it wells up in me. I'm like, oh, it's Bruno time. Also, Magic Heart Mania. Thanks for the uh, seven foot frame for as long as back. Yeah, that's the best part. Also, actually, no. The, uh, the Laura's part is the best part, but then the Camilla part is really good. 
But all of it's good. It's all good. I mean, the, uh... The Isa, Isabella part is probably, like, the part that I like the least, but... I don't like when things get slow, you know? I'm gonna keep that speed going. But the Dolores part, that's, like, Hamilton 101. Um, where am I going? Where am I going? I'm getting sick! Stop it! Dizzy! Um, I guess we'll go to Olympus. That's what's next in the combat level order. Ah. <sighs> Rowdy Rumble! Jesse, what are you talking about? Hamilton World? Hopefully it ends with a Thomas Jefferson boss fight. Oh my god, the tournament, you're right, it's timed too. Fuck me. Fuck me running. I feel like people are starting to pick up on the things that I say a lot, and now I'm like, trying not to be such a predictable broken record. But people point out how often I say, fuck me running! Which is something I picked up from a college friend, I didn't usually, I didn't really say it until maybe like, 2018 or so. I say, fuck me running, I say, I will die on this hill. David Russell pointed out that I always say the blank of it all. Like, I'd be like, oh, well, when concerned with the unversed of it all, um, I always say of it all. Um, what else do I say? I mean, Lingual Logic has pretty much uh, nailed my general cadence. I <laughs> started saying fuck me running a lot. I like to do the thing where I go, sh like, shit, piss, damn, and also bitch. Yeah, like, like Owl said, dick and also balls. That's something I picked up from Sam, actually. That's not Pat Original, either. I'm just kind of a sponge, you know? The Die on the Silt thing is kind of a, a me thing, though. People like to make fun of that time where I like to use the word granular a lot. A lot. <laughs> I say a lot, a lot. A lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot. Axolotl, my favorite animal. Not really, it's actually a giraffe. Did Nomura say Hercules was a favorite Disney movie? It would make a lot of fucking sense, because we have to see it so goddamn much. And I like Hercules, too. It's probably in, like, my personal top ten Disney movies. I just think it's neat! That's- you're so right. Obviously, I'm just, like, riffing on the Marge thing. But, uh, I do, like, uh, to say that a lot. I, I say it, like, probably at least once every other video. I just think it's neat. Yeah, I've always liked giraffes. Wait, what word do I say a lot? Fuck? Oh no! I was always enchanted by giraffes because there was a girl in school who would always pick on me for being short, and giraffes were tall, so I always admired giraffes, you know? I'm not even a short person now, I was just a short kid. Like, I'm like average height at this point. Uh, maybe a little below average, I don't know. Also, I thought it was sick that uh, I saw a giraffe and it stuck its tongue out at me at, at the zoo once. It had like a fucking gray tongue. It was, uh, it was just enchanting to me. What species of giraffes? I couldn't get that, uh, specific. That'll cost you extra. How tall was I? I- I don't know. I was, like, the, like, third shortest kid in my class, I would say. I'm not, like, I don't really, uh... I'm not, uh, big on, like, keeping track of the height. It doesn't matter to me that much. I think I'm, like, 5'9". Um... I'm not 5'1". <laughs> Confirmed. I mean, guy, like, we're like the same height, are we not? Like, how old, how tall are you, uh, Geisifer? Because I'm like, whatever height you are. Oh, fuck me! I thought I wasn't 1 HP there. 5'11? Okay, I might be like 5'10 then. You might be a little bit taller. I don't think I'm 5'11. Ouchie, ouch. Any other questions? Any other brain busters for me? I'm an open book tonight. <laughs> Lamau! Wow, you're taller than the funny YouTube man. Carly, no. No! Fuck Imagine Dragons. Imagine Monkey. So do giraffes wear their ties on the top of their necks or at the base? I think at the base, if we're being realistic. I'm a 5'11 woman, so basically a giraffe. I had a Dragon Tales reference in this last uh, YouTube video. What's the capital of South Dakota? Is it Bismarck? Bismarck is definitely a capital. What did I use my college degree for before this channel? Fucking nothing good, I tell you that much. I don't even know if I'm using it for good right now. I mean, it's mass comm. I guess I... You know what? Listen to this. I'm fucking communicating more massively than anybody else who fucking graduated with my major. So... Um... 
What did I do? Well, I was a freelance writer for um, a local newspaper. Um, and I also did some work for a um, media management company. Um, thank you for the 100 bits. Um, Magic Card Mania. If I consider Disney shows to be possible worlds, like Phineas and Ferb, Gravity Falls, um, I've definitely thought about it. Like, it's, you know, the tumbleweed is rolled around in my head. But um, I don't think it'll happen. Um, I just don't think Nomura... Like, Nomura has to be a fan of the content. I think at least be... Or at least be, like, somewhat familiar with it. Um, and I don't know how big he is on the television shows. But if, if there was one, I would want it to be Gargoyles, which I never even watched as a kid, but I think it would be really cool. Um, also, hi, Black Belt. Um, what else? Um, I did play the saxophone for... Um, and Guy can corroborate that. I played the saxophone for about a semester in fourth grade, maybe? Um, our band teacher was a bad guy. So, um, what else? And we're just answering questions now? No, I was not a band kid, though. I mean, I fucking... I was so bad. I didn't practice. Um, and I was I was bad at the saxophone, and the band teacher was mean, and it turned out to be kind of a creepo. So, um, did I play sports? Did okay. Very very astute observation, Carly. I did not uh, did not run track, but I did run in high school. That's a long story <laughs> that I'm not gonna tell. Guy knows what I'm talking about. Um, I could run up walls. That's right. I got in trouble one time in gym class. Not in gym class, actually. We were coming in from recess, and we had to go through the gym. And, um, my gym had these flags on the wall. Like, I think it, they all... I don't know what the flags were, but they, like, represented different sports, maybe. Um, and they were, like, relatively high up the wall. So we, there was this thing we would like to play, where we tried to, like, run up the wall and touch the flag, because they were, like, just barely out of reach. So I did that once when we were coming in from, uh, recess... While there was a gym class going on for kindergartners, I ran up the wall, touched the flag, and then gym teacher yelled at me and basically put me in a timeout. Um, that was like one of the few times I got in trouble in school. I'm not a hot pocket guy. I don't really like hot pockets. Um, bam, 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 bam. In Greek mythology, Hercules kills Meg because Hera struck him with the fit of madness. You're right. Yeah, I remember actually uh, reading about that in uh, Latin class um, in seventh grade. Exclusive Patreon lore. No, I did. So yeah, to to uh, to elaborate on the running thing, I did not do cross country. I thought about um, signing up for it in my freshman year, but I decided against it just because I don't know the whole trauma of entering high school was a lot for me. <laughs> I didn't feel like uh, didn't feel like uh, really sticking around after school to do stuff if I didn't have to. Um, also, Ruthie said, "Did you know when I first played this game, it was the first time I ever saw or heard of Zach? Me too. Not long after playing this game, my brother got a crisis score, and needless to say, I was a mess at the end of it all. I haven't played crisis score, but I'm assuming." Sad stuff happens. I'm getting the burpees from drinking. Sorry. <clears throat> um, what else is going on? Boom, boom, boom. Zach Fair, baby. I feel like I missed something. Oh, yes. Cross country. Yeah, so I did do cross country. I would run um, recreationally in high school. But uh, that was um, all for naught. Let's see. John Solo? I don't think so. Uh, I'm drinking a uh, Mike's Harder Lemonade. Classic Lemonade. Ever been in a fight? No. Um, I got close to being in one at a local bazaar. Kid tried to punch me. Uh, Creek Zero. Thank you for the follow. Um, I believe I was in like second grade or so. Um, I'm not sure what the whole tiff was. But I ran away. <laughs> that was the closest I ever got. I was very young. Good movies. I saw Spider-Man No Way Home. That's the most recent movie I saw. Oh, I saw in Kanto, actually. I watched that with my, my friends over Discord. So that was really good. Um, oh, sorry. Um, what are my most recent movies on Letterboxd? I'm fairly buzzed right now, if that wasn't clear. Okay. My most recent five films... Oh, I forgot to log uh, Spider-Man. We do that right now. Spider-Man No Way Home. So, with that taken into account, my five most recent movies are Spider-Man No Way Home, Encanto, whoa, Nachos. One sec. Nachos gifted five subs to Tony Gabagold, Maori Wargamer, Ranta Ray, Migu RR, and Snurd for 163 total from Nachos. A fucking legend. A legend. 
Thank you so much, Nachos. Um, let me get back to my movie list here. Okay, so it was Spider-Man No Way Home, Encanto, Shang-Chi and the Seven Rings, Black Widow, a lot of Marvel, Luca. Is that five? Yeah. So yes. Uh, basically, it's either Disney or it's Marvel. And it's all Disney, so... And then, but, okay, the, the last non-Disney movie I saw was, if you count it, Bo Burnham's Inside. Um, which is like, you know, it's a Netflix special, I guess, but it, it lets you log it on Letterboxd, so... And then it was Soul, and then it was Hamilton, <laughs> and then it was Frozen 2, and then it was El Camino, a Breaking Bad movie. So, a lot of Disney and Marvel in there, I guess. Didn't really realize. You should use Letterboxd, by the way, if you, if you uh, like to keep track of all the movies you've watched. Letterboxed. Pretty cool. It's like backloggery, but for movies. Or I suppose backloggery is like letterbox for games. Also, Alexa Rose, thank you for the 300 bits, and we have a hype train going right now. And I gotta pee. So we're gonna kill these on a burst, and then I'm gonna pee. Um, I don't think my letterbox is publicly available, is it? It might be. Let me see. Oh, I'm, I have my Twitter handle, so it's uh, the subpar Patsby. Bum, 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 bum. Bum, 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 I think. I don't know. I'm trying to see if I can make it so that... That, uh... People can see. I don't know, whatever. It's not very interesting anyway, so... Um, also, 100 bits from Cosmic Stuff. Oh, what, was the stream epic? Because for me, it was like... You know, kind of a mess, but... Um, sorry, I, I blanked there. Um, yes, yes, of course. I'm glad you got to play. Um, I'm, you probably got to answer some of the questions multiple times, so... Um, yeah. Alright, as long as I everyone else thinks it was a good stream, you know... I'm very hard on myself about these things, I think, but I, I try to treat it like a, like a TV show, you know? So it's like, um, when, uh, when things go wrong, it's like, I imagine that people are losing interest quickly. Which I wouldn't blame them, because it's, time is precious, you know? You only got so many hours. And, uh, I don't want them to be wasted on nonsense like that, you know? Now I'm trying to make progress, but I feel like I've been yapping about myself for the past half hour. The boobery is kind of part uh, part of the fun? Alright. As long as you think the boobery is fun. A little rough around the edges, makes you smile, yeah. That's fair, that's a fair assessment. I'll take that. Come on now, you fuck. I should just go for the combos. Oh wait, I'm gonna die. No, we're good, we're good. Might have got an HP prize plus as well from a uh, command board. I'm not sure though. Wow, way to whiff. I hit one of those out of five. It's crazy. These things are motherfuckers. Oh, get fucking flooded? Really though? Come on. Jesus Christ. Roddy Rumble, why? Why? That's all I have to say. Why is it here? God, the combo just does such chip damage. Oh, it doesn't work! You gotta go. It doesn't pierce. Oh my god, you fuck. What day is it? Oh, it's Tuesday, obviously. <laughs> I'm streaming. I, I literally lost track of, like... I was like, wait. That was stupid. <laughs> if there's anything Green Requiem taught you, it's that Rowdy Rumble is the greatest song ever written. I'm not sure if that was the message he was trying to get across. Also, you clear level 1 hype train, so good job. Some might call it a scam train. 
I wouldn't. But, you know, some might. Boom, boom, boom. I don't want to, like, count eggs before they hatch, but if we do keep this up... Oh! I could potentially apply for... Oh, why did I heal? Um, for partnership. Um, because the only thing I've been lacking is the, uh, the concurrent viewer thing. And, uh, performance, all thanks to you folks, has been pretty astounding these past couple of streams. Even when I'm just, like, fumbling through. Um, do you think uh, so many people like KH2 the best because it was, uh, like, a power trip? I think it has a lot to do with it. I think because KH1 is more frustrating, which, I mean, obviously, a game being frustrating doesn't mean it's good or better. But, um, I think KH1 certainly challenges you more, both in, uh, like, if we're talking, like, a casual first-time playthrough on any difficulty, for a first-time player as a child, you were, like, by far going to be more challenged by both the exploration and the combat in KH1. So when KH2 just, like, lets you do all this flashy shit, and you can really just kind of no-brain your way through so much, and, I mean, you can no-brain through KH1 stuff as well, especially if you've played the game before, but, um, KH2 makes you all powerful and kh1 you're always the underdog i've like i've been standing by that forever you know and some people don't like platforming that's fine for me that was always part of the formula so that's why i always like to see it return um and vulnerability thank you for gifting your first gift sub to vfence thank you so much oh i'm sorry did i i'm sorry you're right daisy thank you for the 100 bits um did someone say scam train yeah you're right in fact i said it after you said it so <laughs> look at that uh apologize for missing that there i was all uh all caught up. But yeah, like, I think because my... Some of my first video games ever were platformers, so... I think when I saw it in KH1, I just kind of assumed that most video games just had that kind of stuff, you know? Like, Pac-Man World 1 was my first game. The Spyro original trilogy were, were soon after. Rayman 1. Um, Egglag, thank you for the three months there. Thank you. Oh, Nacho. See, if I, if I had my order wrong, I would definitely need to be, like, talked into telling the waiter that they got it wrong. Um, I'm the kind of guy that would maybe be like, well, you know, it happens. <laughs> I don't want to cause any trouble. <laughs> was an impression? Oh, jeez. I did try an any percent speed run. I am, like, the second from last um, on the leaderboards. <laughs> so, clearly I'm not as good as you think. But I did it while I was drunk on my birthday. Fuck. Please, No. I've attempted it twice. The first was the drunk time on my birthday, and the second was like a week or so after. I was sober, and I did way worse. Way worse. In fact, I just gave up at the end. Alright, Carly's giving me permission. On behalf of all waiter kind. Um, like, listen, if they, if they uh, don't cook my steak enough, that shit's going back. That's going right back. I should block more mayhaps. Um, are you backseating me, Megadon? Are you backseat gaming right now? What games? What games? Oh, I'm sorry. The games. Got to say the accent. Yeah, you gotta cook it enough. You're goddamn right. I like it well done. I like it very well done. Just like Zaynor. He passed out during my drunk stream. That's fair. I almost did. The games. Yes, guy, you were gifted a sub by Nachos. He's kind of a big deal, Nachos. Is this the last time, canonically, like release order wise, that we hear Phil speak? Does he speak in Coded? And did Coded come out after this? I always forget. I mean, Recoded. I don't know. I know Phone Coded had some episodes out before BBS, but I don't know if Recoded came out after BBS or not. I always forget. They're both 2010, though. I think. I mean, Nachos, you're like the fourth biggest deal here. I mean, we're going by sub count. Or by, like, gifted sub count. Um, Cage Fanfiction. I'm not really a fanfiction guy. Um, I'm kind of snobby about the stuff that I consume, if I'm being honest. This is it. How sad is I'm not interested, because a lot of it has to do with romance and shipping, and I, I find all of that very 
either strange or just not interesting. So. Cage basically is fanfiction, as is Smash Bros. So. Did I buy every console post PS2 specifically for Kingdom Hearts games? PSP is probably the only one where I could say that for sure. PSP I did get, like, um, entirely for BBS. Um, I had Peace Walker on that as well, but I never really played it. I didn't like the how I controlled, so I kind of gave up on it. But I already had a 3DS by the time Dream Drop came out. <laughs> right? It's like, it's fucking weird, like a dog. Like, it's just like, they're children, you know? Um, so... I mean, I, obviously, I ship Larkseen and Daisy, and Ruthie and Luxor, that's a given, but... Like, the Axel Rocks is shit, not gonna fly with me. Not gonna fly. The, uh... The shipping of miners is a strange beast, if you ask me. I guess it's not illegal, but I would frown upon it, you know? But yeah, I got a 3DS in 2011, I think, or whenever the first year it came out. Um... Because I like the uh, Mario platformers and stuff. I do ship Queen's Zord. That's true. Is it Frosty's husband's birthday? Yo, happy birthday. Um, was I a Zelda kid? Um, kind of, like, yes, no. Like, it wasn't, like, something that I was huge on. But, um, Wind Waker is in, like, my top 20. As is uh, Breath of the Wild. But Wind Waker was, like, my first real uh, Zelda game. I had the collection on uh, GameCube as well with, uh... I believe it's Zelda 1, 2, Ocarina, and Majora's Mask. Um, I had Twilight Princess when it came out as well. God, what a historic room this is right here, though. As much as I shit on being in this world all the time. Um, and BBS is probably the worst outing for it out of the four that it's... Well, I guess it's in Days and Coded, too, right? And Chain of Memories. God, it's in so many fucking games. It's not in the mobile game, is it? Um, would I play Brilliant Diamond or Shining Pearl on stream? I, not if I want people to watch my stream. <laughs> I mean, honestly, I, uh, I, I have Shining Diamond, or whatever it is, Brilliant Diamond, um, and I just, like, had no motivation to keep playing it. Um, I'm between, I'm still between the second and third gem, I haven't picked it up in months. DK Country? Yo, guy. Maybe for a Saturday stream. Um, it's weird that Hayes is just standing around. I guess he does that in two as well. But, God, his face is so gross. Ew. Look at that gaping maw. Um, I, I don't think we know the sound origin completely yet, no. Bring One bit? Fucking cheapskate. <laughs> he is simply standing there. No braces in ancient Greece, yeah. I had, I had braces, by the way. That's another pat fun fact. I had braces for about <coughs> a year and a half, I think. When I was in freshman year of high school. Yeah, why is he allowed here? Like, where's Phil? Where's security? Is Phil the entire security team? Um, braces didn't do me a ton of good, obviously, if you know anything about me, that my teeth is, is uh, my teeth situation is a disaster. It's getting better now, though. Um, got a great dentist. I did not wear headgear, no. I wouldn't, I also didn't wear my retainer. God, I, honestly, I, I'm very privileged to be able to say this, but, like, probably the, like, top five worst pain I've been in was, like, the day after I got my braces. I was just, like, laid up on the couch all day. Um, it is frosty. In fact, maybe I can risk running my chatbot now, because everything seems to have stabilized. My internet was just, like, fucking not playing nice. Like, right at 6 o'clock. You know? But yeah, at the start of the Ice Colossus fight, as Aqua, Hades will say, All I owe is frosty. But yeah, um, and the rubber bands uh, segment, like, the pre-braces of having the rubber bands in... God, that fucking sucked. Is it any better now? Like, has anything progressed over the past 10-ish, 12-ish years? Because, um... The whole time I was like, this feels medieval. Like, all of this. And I know it used to be even worse. No? Like, the rubber band part, fucking, it was the worst. Invisalign. I guess there's that. I, I never really cared about the physicality of braces, right? Like, the, the, the visual aspect? Like, whatever, you know? So does everybody else in my grade. They all had braces. It was the pain. It was the the discomfort, you know. I I'm very obsessive in the way of like like feeling my uh my teeth with my tongue, you know. But wow, you still gotta do through the, the go through the fucking rubber bands thing and all that. Jesus. Why aren't they working on that? They should be working on like the cure to cancer. 
Shit. When are you gonna tell me how to conquer the darkness? Hold your chair. Gotta bless my parents for fucking investing in an orthodontist for me and then You know that that obviously didn't pan out. Not that I miss an impression. Hey, listen, this is the I think this is the fastest chat's ever moved. So I do apologize. What's this? Was it like a year ago? Come on. Favorite god? Why is that on the application? Or was he just was he ad libbing? Sweet, really. And hey, by the time you win the final match here, you'll have Yo, to figure out how to conquer. I got I had two wisdom teeth. I got them taken out. I was fucking fine. Like I had no pain the next day. Um <laughs> I got it. I don't know if it's like uh if you have all, all four taken out that it's way worse. I'm sure it must be more painful. But um because my sister was like, you know, she was fucking wrecked by the wisdom teeth. But I was fine. And I wasn't even funny when I woke up. As per usual, am I right? Um, everyone's like, oh my god, get a recording. And I was just like... Because my mom took me. And um, I, I guess she stepped out to like go grab a coffee like during the uh, the whole thing. And she wasn't there when uh, when I woke up. So um, the, I guess the only funniest thing I said when she, when she got back is I said, You fucking abandoned me. <laughs> Which, like, in fairness, she kind of did. But, you know... I would have signed off on it if I was of well mind. I'd be like, yeah, you get a copy. But I didn't know how upset I would be when I woke up. Um, I actually had um, a very minor surgery in, um, was it like late middle school? Oh, yeah, I forgot about this. Um, so when I was like a kid, I don't know when I realized or discovered it, but I had like this thing on my tongue, uh, like the side of my tongue there. And it was like, um, I think the doctor called it like an overgrown taste bud of some kind. It was, it, it looked like a little, like a tumor on my tongue. Um, I was like concerned once it started like getting in the way of like me eating. It wasn't like huge. It was like very small, but um, I wanted it removed because it, it started to cause me a bit of aggravation. Um, so I had to go under for that. I was, uh, had anesthesia. And when I woke up from that, I was just like off the walls. I was like talking about how like I was on, uh, oh, I do have to pee. You're right. Um, <laughs> I do. Thanks for keeping track of my biological needs. Um, I was like, the gravity's different here on Jupiter. Like, I was just saying shit about, like, being on a different planet or something. Um, my parents were giving me the recap after it was all said and done. I was very upset because, like, the room where I went under, there was a clock on the wall. And when I woke up, it was gone. So I was, like, I was, like, really upset that somebody stole the clock. I did not. No, it was just—it was basically like a, like a like a fucking protrusion on my tongue. That uh, it was like a very very amusing like playground thing to show off, you know, as like a like a freak of nature sort of biological uh, deformity on my tongue. Um, so I would like you know regale people with the uh, the small second tongue, as I like to call it. But um, then it started to be like painful when eating, so I got removed. There's a fun fact for you. Wow. It's already been three hours. I guess Kahoot took up a lot of time. I'm gonna go for a little bit more, though. Because, I mean, I, I gotta finish this mics at least. Probably act a little faster. Large taste bud Pat, they used to call me. You're goddamn right. Say my name. <laughs> You're done, he said. Oh, wait. Okay. Um, least favorite food is a weird question. I mean, probably something I've ne never tried before, right? Um, like, what is the least good food I've ever tried? No! Fuck me. Come on. Ooh, you're right, Carly. I fucking hate green apple Skittles. <laughs> Carly knows. You don't like tomatoes? I'm like, I'm neutral on tomatoes. I'm not a fish guy, though. Tell me how to conquer the darkness. 
Honestly, Gavaka, that's a fucking mood, you know? Um... I would go under for a cleaning if it were up to me. Because I don't like when they're picking at your teeth. Ow! So if they could just knock me out for that shit, that's fine. Go, Dresh. I gotta get my D-Link bar back up. Any more brain busters? I don't like being picked and prodded. Oh wait, no, you know what? Actually, no, no more questions, because I have to... <laughs> I have to kill this guy. No, that's not gonna happen. Oh, Foldy Arms Terra. That's not a death, though. We don't count these. Favorite farm animal? Hmm. I like to eat cows. If that counts. Are you the one who breaded me, Tony? Because I did get breaded. There's a YouTuber who just breads people, and I, it was sent to me. I was breaded. Um, cow, I guess, is my answer. Did I play any old PC games like Mr. Nancy Drew? No, I'm familiar with Mist. Um, never played it. I mean, I did certainly play, like, older PC games. Um, most of them were, like, educational, like, uh, Disney tie-in things, you know? Oh, yeah, I sent you the, vid the bread video. Guy knows. Regular Pat, you just got breaded. And then he did a Spongebob laugh, and then he said that he was like, Oh, by the way, Cage 2 is better than 1. And I was like, son of a bitch. Who did this to me? You know, I said I was going to, Anders, but um, analytics-wise, I just, you know... It probably wouldn't have been the best option. He wasn't... I mean, it's hard, to, it's hard to say, Guy, because I only saw his top half, but there's no saying that he wasn't fully naked, you know? Um, that's his little secret. <laughs> we'll never know. Uh, so it's exactly what it sounds like. Uh, <laughs> there was a man. He was reclined. He had no shirt on. And he, uh, he said, Regular Pat, you just got breaded. And then he hit his webcam with a piece of white bread. And then he did the Spongebob laugh, and then he told me that Cage 2 is better than 1. And that was it. Then he was off into that good night. And he's done this to many people. I'm not special. I did not play Carmen San Diego, no. I am aware of it, but I did not play it. Um, I had a lot of Sesame Street games um, on PC. Oh, fuck me. Are you kidding? I don't know if I have the mental capacity to handle it. Maybe we should just go to Deep Space. I have to pee. That's right. Let me go pee. Be right back. Enjoy the bopperino. The bopperini. Or the ad. Alright. One sec.
Hello. Okay, we're back. You ever see that vine of the professor that they they take like a video of him going into his classroom every day and he says hello the same way every time? You know what I'm talking about? Does anybody know what I'm talking about? He's like an older gentleman with white hair and he goes, hello. Okay, yeah, you know, <laughs> you know it. Okay, good. <laughs> so just know whenever I say hello, that's what I'm referencing. Anytime I say or type hello with you, I'm referencing that guy. Anytime I say thank you, I'm referencing Jack Skellington. Thank you. Because I got great vine taste, baby. <laughs> Another uh, favorite vine of mine that I posted in the patron channel recently was, You're all going to hell. Goodbye. <laughs> I love that. Oh, it's so good. You got a guy. You got to die. You got to die. Come on. All right. Okay. That's right. I need a Blue's Clues game. The Blue's Treasure Hunt. That was my shit. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying, Emily. I want that. I just don't know a good way to do it, you know? I need to acquire them first, and it's like... I'm not sure what avenues I take to do that. Because I don't really know a good way. Like, you know, if I wanted to play, like, Pokemon Emerald, I could do that right now. But if I wanted to play... Oh, I fucking love Pajama Sam. Fuck. I have that on Steam. But, um... Like, if I wanted to play, like, the Tarzan Activity Pack, I don't know how to do that, you know? Don't you have to, like, downgrade your computer to make that work? Freddy Fish, Putt Putt, Spy Fox. I fucking love Pokemon Emeralds. Carly was just dunking on me yesterday because it's it's above Cage 2 in my world rankings. You know, what if I shot lock these? Wow, that's fucking pathetic. Well, throw that out. Oh, no. <sighs> Clue Finder. I have not. I had a um, I Spy game. It was like in a haunted mansion or something. <laughs> Video game series I've always wanted to try. Um, hmm. What have I always wanted to try, but I haven't yet? Let me think. For a while it was Metroid, and I played a little bit of Super Metroid. I was like, oh yeah, this is fine. Um, maybe it's not, not for me. Kind of same with Castlevania. Actually, Ega Dog, I don't disagree with that. I would like to play that at some point. God, I feel like I'm very itchy now. Um, what else? I don't know. I feel like if I want to play something, I go and play it. If I really want to, you know. Anything PlayStation exclusive, yeah. I feel like I always had, like, an unfair distaste for Halo as a kid because all the kids that I didn't like in school loved Halo and Call of Duty, so I never wanted to play either of those. Um, but I feel like Halo has got some more meat to it than Call of Duty. <clears throat> See, Guy agrees. Oh my god, can I get this guy? It's the shoegazers afterwards that's the problem. I have no idea how to deal with these fuckers coming up. Like, 15 seconds for this? Fuck me. Because they guard. It's like, what am I going to do with that shit? Ugh. Make it happen, Terra. You got to be fucking me right now. Ugh. I might need to, like, research on a strat for that. That's the strongest Keyblade I have physically. Big Thunder? Like, Big Pharma? I'm gonna get Big Thunder on this. Hmm. Well, I might as well merge these. You are now merged. Drop your buffs. Let's see. And why not just throw some fucking... Chaos! Magic Haste. Okay. Might as well, right? I mean, why not? Thundara. Fusion Strike, that's not useful at all. Can someone say I could, I could combine Asuna with Block? Or Renewal something? Renewal Block? But I'm not allowed to? Question mark? You can't combine? Favorite ride? Probably Space Mountain. Um, I love True Colors. I played it on, on here. 
So go play it and then go watch my playthrough of it. It's great. I had a fun time. I had so much fun playing that. Um, I need a second block. Oh, but I but it won't even let me. So wait, Asuna is just blocked off until I have a second block. <coughs> That's weird. Is Asuna the only thing you can combine with block? Bum, 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 bum. Well, I mean, fuck this. No. But what I'm saying is, like, I, I get what you mean about, like, not being able to do it without a second block. But, like, why is Asuna blocked off right now? You know what I mean? Quintess Space Mountain is the quintessential cis-het riot? What does that even mean? What does that mean? You What? That's crazy talk. I can't believe this. Every Everything everything that's my favorite is, like, oh, typical fucking boring straight guy. Which, alright, I guess I'll, I believe you, but... Explain it to me. Explain it. I'm trying to learn. There's no way it's pronounced Esuna. Really? Don't gaslight me. It's not Asuna. Why not? Shut up. Are there any anyone else anyone else in chat who likes Space Mountain the best who is not cishet? Also, unironically, when when cishet started being a thing that was said, I thought it was pronounced Sishay. <laughs> hey, it's Eric94. Thanks for the follow. Yeah, Asuna. Yeah. I think Asuna sounds way better than Esuna. Are you kidding me? Are you fucking nuts? And right, Kingdom Hearts. You're right. If Kingdom Hearts is my favorite video game, that is definitely not the, the set choice. Am I right? I mean, Sishay. It's funny, isn't it? Like, I only saw it. Like, no one pronounced it. I just saw it on the internet for like a year. And I was like, Sishay? Asuna. Asuna Matata. Don't speak such nonsense. As opposed to all the other nonsense. Space Mountain's like my favorite like fast ride, and then I also really like the Toy Story Mania shooting ride. And before that, I really liked the Buzz, Light, the Buzz Lightyear, uh... What is it? Space Ranger spin, where you shoot the things. I like getting to shoot things in parks. <laughs> Which sounds unhinged, but like, when it's put into a, a game format, it's really fun. Don't bring weapons to Disney World is the moral of the story. <clears throat> Yeah, I haven't been to Disney World in... God, it's probably been since, like, 2011 or 12. I went when I was a freshman in high school. I think that was the last time. Esune. It's actually pronounced Mishuna. Rides the shoe puff? Alright, I'm gonna go to deep space, because I don't think I can handle time limit right now. Oh, wait. I was trying to leave the world like you can in KH1. That's not how it works. You gotta use a save point. Miss Porter. Oh, Paul, can you suggest it again? Because I missed it. I'm a big Figment guy, yeah. I mean, I don't have, like, Figment merch, but... Um, I have not been to Disneyland. I have not been to California. I have not re really gone very west. Um, what's the westest I've been? Probably, like, a fucking layover in... Michigan, maybe. <laughs> like, that's that's how west we're talking. Um, I'm not a big traveler, if I'm being honest. I've only uh, been to... Outside the U.S., I've only been to the Bahamas. Oh. Um, so, I mean, I, I, I should say you should... Yeah, you should job hunt. <laughs> I mean, uh, you can have me on the background. What should Jungle Line do? Job hunt... Job hunt plus. Or no. So it's either it's either just me, just patch stream, or job hunt plus stream. I mean, my vote is you know, job hunt. <clears throat> I haven't seen heals today. Also, this should be cathartic. Let's get cathartic! She let Hermione on Twitch? What? What's happening? Oh. I meant two. I still don't understand. Wow, we just fucking crushed that. I wasn't even looking at the screen. For this west is Pennsylvania. Wow. <clears throat> yeah, don't... Yeah. Help Jungle Wine job hunt. As soon as only used for renewal block. Okay, thank you, Wells. I, I was like, am I nuts? That's nuts. Huh? What? 
Oh, Terra, you silly bully. You know what's crazy? All my life, I've been saying, like, in reference to New York, is like, oh, yeah, going up to New York. Like, oh, yeah, I'm going up to New York for the weekend. But New York is south of me. Even though I'm in Pennsylvania, like, the city of New York is south of where I live. Which is, like, it blows my fucking mind. I didn't even really realize it until, I don't know, like, a couple of months ago. All my life. Well, yeah, I guess I dox myself a little bit. I mean, people already know that I live in Nipah. But, um... Isn't that weird? Because the city is like... It's like on the fucking ass of New York State. It's like dripping off of it, you know? So it's weird. Yeah, Boston's north of me, but that makes sense. That always made sense to me. But it's like, if you're in Pennsylvania, New York City should be north of you. It's fucked up. It shouldn't be that way. Yes, Grand Councilwoman. <laughs> find him until we can determine what Guy docks with me. But I thought you lived at 123 Plainville Lane. <clears throat> Any Coloradans in here? Colorado. I'm a giraffe. See, we brought it back to giraffes. Take cover. Leave it to me bum, bum, to bum, 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 bum. New York is too far away. It usually is, isn't it? It's the city of dreams. The city of memes. Unversed. Are we talking Castle Oblivion or Colorado? You gotta be specific. Unversed! How many times did the trio say unversed? Exclamation point. Oh yeah, we got our first snow. If you're up in the north recently. Not just who you asking about. Terra? Or Gantu. That's a... I want to say Keith Michael Richardson? I think? No? Yeah, Gantu. I want to say it's... Or Kevin Michael Richardson. I think is his name. I think? And he's somebody else, too. In, uh... Kevin. Yeah, I got it. Um... Was he, like, the... Because he's not original Sebastian, but I feel like somebody took over to be Sebastian... And it might be him. That's gonna bother me. I need to know now. I need to know now. It's my Sebastian, and I need it now. J. G. Wentworth. Sebastian, are you Kevin Michael Richardson? I can't spell. He is. Yeah. So he's not original Sebastian from Little Mermaid, but he does take his. Uh, Take his place for a cage. Bum, bum, bum. Bum, bum. He might be one other character in cage. I could be wrong. <clears throat> oh, wasn't he cast as um? He's cast as somebody for the Mario movie as well. Uh, I can picture it right now. He's next to Fred Armisen. Fred Armisen was Cranky Kong, and. Kevin Michael Richardson is somebody else. Uh, Frosty, thank you for gifting the 218th gift sub to Tristan. Thank you. He's Kamek. Kamek? How do you, oh, yeah. Let's do another fucking pronunciation discussion. Is it it's Kamek or Kamek? I think I've always said Kamek. I don't think anyone's ever spoken that. Maybe in the uh, Super Mario Super Show, but I never watched that. Or is it just Magic Koopa? Kamek? Absolutely not. Kamak? I don't. I don't like any of that. You know what's crazy is that this is the room where you actually get the chest for high jump, and I had no idea you can get it through the command board before this. Kind of crazy. Maybe even cringe. No. Also, Rowdy Rumble again, though. It's a good song. Is a thing. But, um, as David makes abundantly clear, they use it way too much. Like, what does it mean? It doesn't mean anything anymore. It used to kind of mean, hey, it's a peep fight. And now it's like, eh, some crazy's happening. There you go. Job hunt. And this, I believe, is... Is this, uh, David... David... 
uh, Ogden? Ogden? David Ogden Styers? I'm not sure if I'm saying the name right, but he's also Cogsworth, and I think he passed away after this game. Time for a hoedown. He is bulletproof, fireproof, and can think faster than supercomputer. <clears throat> he can see in the dark and move objects 3,000 times his rather diminutive size. If I were to rank the characters by how stinky they are, I think Dr. Jumba would be top 10 with a bullet. The other alien, Pleakley, you know, it's uh, his model is in the game's code, famously. Um, so they had plans to have Pleakley in here. But they did not include him. He was evil purple man, Governor Radcliffe. There you go. I had no idea he was also Radcliffe. I never finished Pocahontas. I got halfway through it and I was like, fuck this. Fuck all of this. Yeah, Pleakley was definitely better than Dr. Jumbo. But real quick, stinkiest Kingdom Hearts characters. Jumbo's up there. Um... I can't imagine that Fred smells good. Pence. Pete. Yeah. Michael. See, I don't like Michael, but he probably doesn't smell that bad. Anthem in the Diz outfit. <laughs> Bleakly is a fellow gay. <laughs> Confirmed. Barbosa. Yeah. I mean, all the pirates probably don't smell great. Anyone in the pirates world. The entire uh, Port Royal cast. Stinky. I mean, they're pirates. They're not washing. Vexen's definitely stinky, yeah. I'm not even saying that just to appease Gavaka. I think that's totally true. Vexen, big stink, yes. I can't imagine that Lumpy smells great, but maybe it's just the name. Lumpy. I mean, Gopher is in the dirt all day, but he probably smells earthy, you know? Kind of earthy. How do I still only have the fucking mineshaft keyblade? What am I doing? Items. It's so weird that it's in items. This is the strongest keyblade I have. That's crazy. I'm still using the fucking treasure track. Treasure... What is this? Treasure trove. KH1 Riku stinky? I don't know. I don't know about that. I feel like most people who associate closely with darkness are not stinky in a bad way. Like, they definitely have a scent. They're pungent. But it's like, uh, as I've said before, it's like your dad's cologne. Vexen smells of formaldehyde. <laughs> oh my god. Let's bottle a smell for each character. The dark pajamas probably do smell. They were probably in like a musty trunk. Maleficent like, from Maleficent, when Maleficent had her, her nephew over. So she had a, a pair of PJs for him to wear to bed. Like, PJ! PJ! <laughs> no, darkness does not smell like cigarettes. I, I promise you it smells like your dad's cologne. Like, I'm, I've never been more sure of something. Zigbar smells like cigarettes. And your dad's cologne. It smells like both. Turn up the game volume on the... Okay. On the cutscenes. I mean, I've been yapping over them anyway. Unfortunately, this is not the place to be if you want to experience the cutscenes and all of their grandeur. Mega Poach. Never gonna use it. Well, if your dad smells like cigarettes, then I guess that's his cologne. Brutal Blast! It was a brutal blast. The Brutal Blast! The Keyblade Graveyard Smash. No! Fuck! Fuck me! I feel like I've, uh... I've been in this prison block forever. Oh, okay, I was mistaken. I thought people were here for my insight. He did the Keyblade Mash. Get the fuck, God. Get the fuck, God. Oh, man. I just want what's in that little pod on this left side. Terra's butt is not very pronounced unless he's in the armor, though. You know? What do I gotta do? What do I gotta do? These, this one moves. Oh, you fucker! Get the fuck, God. Cody, look at me. Cody, are you paying attention? I see you. Don't fuck with me, Cody. <laughs> Alright. I think I'm going to try to get this item and get to a save point, and maybe we're going to call it. 
because <laughs> I am uh, I'm a little impeded right now, I believe. I'm gonna free this invisible prisoner just for my own peace of mind. I thought there was a high jump command. Am I mistaken? Like I already have it, so it's fine. But I could have sworn, unless I got it, I want that sticker. No! Oh my god, I'm saved. Oh wait, there's a thing down there. All right, flying balloon sticker. Are you where? Oh, I do. Okay, I did get it. Okay, good. Treasure, th uh, treasure thing for VBS. Um, I don't know. Like, my thing with the KH1 guide is the reason I did it is because there is no in-game thing that um lets you know how much you've accomplished. But every every other game has a thing that lets you know. And there's literally there was no like comprehensive KH1 um treasure thing. That's why I did it. But I feel like there's probably like a fucking IGN guide for all the other KH games for treasure. Which doesn't mean I won't do it, but they're just so plainly in the open. I mean, some of them are tricky, obviously, but it's mostly about getting to them, not knowing where they are, you know. All right, we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna shut down. <laughs> as as much fun as I'm having, um, I believe the time has come. Just for pacing purposes, I'm gonna I'm gonna research how to uh, how I can maybe more cleanly get through the uh, time limit part of uh, Olympus because I have no idea how I'm supposed to kill like six shoe gazers in 15 seconds on level one. That seems highly unlikely. So, um, hey guys, thank you so much for joining me tonight. Um, I. You know, I, I don't want to, like, retread over all of it, but this whole uh, Kahoot and the internet going out, was it was a mess. But, you know, the fact that so many people stuck around um, really does fill me with happiness. <laughs> so, because um, I don't know if I would have the same patience. I'd, I'd like to think that I would. I like to think if it was someone that I really enjoyed, I would stick around through the, uh, the bullshit. So, um, yeah. Okay. Yeah, I think everybody's linked all my stuff. Or you can go to regularpat.com. It has every every single me-related thing on it. Twitch, Twitter, YouTube, both channels, the Wayfinder Project, as per Frosty's recommendation, the Discord, the Patreon. It's all there. Um, fee picks. Yeah, you can get my fee picks if you become a $75 patron. Follow me on Twitter. Uh, I'm not going to raid because I don't want to watch anything right now. So... Um, you all take it easy. We're going to be back on Thursday at 6 p.m. And that'll be fun. We, we'll be terror again. I'll hopefully get through the Olympus uh, Cup. And I'll see you all then, okay? So, take it easy. Stay safe. Stay kind. Stay courteous. Love yous. I'll see you then. All right? Bye-bye.